very early on, it was clear to my parents that uh, I was going to be a visual artist, and they encouraged that, and so did my uh, teachers. Um, the first exhibit <coughs> that I was in was in grade school. It was a clown plaster head I made, and I loved the process. And um, the cherry on top was that it was selected to be exhibited, but uh, at that point, you couldn't tell me anything. So some things um, <laughs> uh, stay the same, some, some things change. Uh, but you will see some clown imagery in here. Now, the images that you're going to see of these spaces, they aren't necessarily from uh, specific individuals. They're more composites of uh, ideas I like and explore a lot. Family, husband, wife, mother, father, daughter, neighbor, stranger. Um, again, the stranger that I just told you about will probably become a portrait of something like that, <laughs> that experience. Um, these are mixed media. Uh, the range in terms of dates are around 2008 to 2013. Uh, they're all untitled. The blue nose I spoke of earlier, when I did the clown, that clown had a blue nose. And here's again. I use, like I said, mixed media, so you may have an acrylic collager, linen, fabric, thread, yarn, dye. Sometimes with the mask imagery, especially when you see an open mouth, that may represent talking or crying or singing. In graduate school, I had a dear friend who's a fashion, uh, fashion designer, and he loved, obviously, dealing with fabrics and threads and things. And he would respond to my work, which was not cut out at that point, um, not the way it is um, that you see. and. Uh, so my interaction with him, I think, really opened me up to um, dealing with the line, which I love, as the character of line, the direction of line, to use thread as another way of drawing. Um, and so I really credit um, John with that. There's a new work called the, I call it work in progress. Uh, it'll be a portrait, but this will be definitely specific that still might be abstract in terms of the facial imagery, but uh, an acquaintance of mine was murdered, and so I want to um, sort of depict my experience of him. Again, it's uh, not a <coughs> close acquaintance, but someone that um, once he died, I realized how much uh, I knew about him, and so that will be probably an installation piece. Ties and um, long ties and bow ties are also I like to represent uh, male boy figures. Sometimes females, but generally male. Thank you.